What's up everyone? It's Lens Addict here. I'm wearing a green shirt today to unbox the green, but also it's blue, uh, iMac. <laughs> it's so heavy in this box. Um, we're going to unbox it today and do a quick review of all the specs and how it works and what the box is like. Something really cool is that the handle on the box stretches. So the old ones used to be plastic. This one, it's like a kind of automatically comes in and out as you need it, but it's much easier to just hold it like this. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> let's unbox this device. Here are the specs on this back. There you can have a read. Pause the video if you see anything you want to read. Uh, let's get started. This is probably the largest product I've ever unboxed. And this is the longest pull tab. Look how long! That's very long. Alright, I think it opens like this now. Feels a bit unnerving. Opening it like that. <laughs> Maybe I've done it the wrong way. <laughs> I think it's upside down in there. <laughs> in the box is this strange, like, bouncy thing. I presume that this protects the screen from being damaged. All right, now we'll open up the sides. Oh, this is very nice. The whole thing kind of opens up logically. And I think that's the Mac. We will put the Mac to the side and then we'll continue the unboxing. It's very nice how everything's color coded here. This is very, very nice. Oh wow, that is really nicely presented. It's a shame that this lid doesn't stay open though. Oh, we'll just hold it. Here is the magic mouse. That's new, there's a sticker on there. On the underside of the mouse. That was not there before. It's nice how this is a color matched mouse too. This is a very nice lightning cable with color matching. It's very pretty. So I'm in Australia, we get an Australian plug, and this is new. Well, it's not really. This is Apple's version of a, one of those kettle plugs. Very exciting, but yeah, it's all right. Here is some of the accessories. 
of the paper manual. Wow, it's very nicely printed. Interesting, it's got battery disposal, but ah uh, no, the key one and mouse have built in battery, so that makes sense. Oh, looks like we got a color, colorful Apple sticker, very nice. It's greeny silver, almost slightly blue even. I just realized there's another sticker that is truly blue and slightly green as well. So look at that, you get two in this box, that's cool. That is the biggest power adapter for a Mac I've ever seen. It's very big. Look at that, it's a big boy. It's got ethernet built in. Let's see what the outputs are on this. All right, let's have a look. Oh, that's a lot of power. So it is 15.9 volts at 9 amps. Wow. They've even polished the uh, power connectors inside of the, the thing here. I think that didn't go how Apple intends it to go. Oh. <laughs> this is definitely not going how Apple intends it to go. <laughs> it's a very effective cat toy. <laughs> it's so long, I can't do it one go. <laughs> oh, far out. Look at this. <laughs> that is a peel. Looks like there's a little bit left still. We'll finish this off. So on the top, we can see there's two microphones here, and there's also one on the back, just there. We also get two Thunderbolt 3 and two USB 4, or maybe USB 3, I can't exactly remember. It's pretty cool that they are color matched. Isn't that impressive? It's also where the power connects, and Ethernet, and the power button. Very clicky. 
And on the side, you can see how thin this is. My finger is fatter. <laughs> and then there's the headphone jack. And here is the display. It'll never be this clean again. It's kind of trippy of all the lights. No Apple logo on the front, just a big chin where all the hardware is. There is an Apple logo in the back. And it's glass or maybe plastic. And that's where all the RF signal or radio frequency comes out. I think it's plastic, to be honest. You can see the hinge. And it kind of rotates very smoothly on this hinge. Mind you, on carpet is very sketchy. <laughs> really wants to fall over. Oh, there you go, it fell over. <laughs> you can see underneath here some of the uh, more labels and the serial number. You can also see uh, the grill where some of its cooling, cooling is. Speakers come out of here. And we can also take a look at this uh, power adapter, and that's where the Ethernet. I think these outer pins are Ethernet, and the inner is everything else. So let's plug it in. Let's see if it works as advertised. It's MagSafe version 3. <laughs> oh, let's try again. Well, it definitely doesn't plug in as magically as I was expecting, but maybe with some turning. Yeah, there we go. Very solidly connects. I'm like pulling at it pretty heavily here. And it's pretty hard to get undone, so I can't see this coming undone accidentally. Oh, it's pretty cool. It tells you how to get the mouse and everything set up. So we'll turn that on. Turn uh, this on. And it says hello on the screen. Looks like we got a mouse. Oh, even the setup screen is color themed. That's really nice. So from the factory, this comes with uh, 11.3, so we will go software update, and we will update this Mac, and see if it's any better. We'll give it a little speaker test. Out of the box, it appears that uh, the magic keyboard and magic mouse are quite charged. It's pretty cool how they're color matched to the Mac itself. Even the uh, mouse is color matched, which is amazing. I really like that. Hello everyone, uh, this is a bit of a webcam test. Uh, it looks pretty good on my screen. Another fun fact, I'm going to edit the whole video on this Mac itself. So it's a good test of the M1 chip. So far I'm almost done editing and I've blown away. It's very fast. Speedy. Uh, and it's really easy to edit on this actually. Um, just so fast. I'm really enjoying it. There, anyway, we'll go back to the main video now.
thank you so much everyone for watching the unboxing of this device um, i hope you enjoyed it and if you liked it give a like if you didn't like it give a dislike uh, and if you want to ask some questions chuck some comments down below and i will uh respond when i can and i'll give you some updates if you have anything you want to know about the mac and subscribe if you want to see more footage like this anyway that's lens addict out see you guys next time